Hey guys, this is Monogrant, and I'm back today with another Roblox exploit. Today we're going to be looking at something called Chronotree. Um, this this is like a pretty, it's like a, it's an older hack, but it got updated and it's working really good. It's got the uh, script injection and it's also got commands that you can use. So this is a pretty, pretty awesome hack. So let's go ahead and get into the videos. First, what you're going to want to do is go to this link right here. Like I said, it has script injection and it's also got commands. I'm gonna wait for the five seconds. Click skip add. It's gonna pop up this window. Now we're gonna click on the right button download through your browser. Wait for it to download. And once it's downloaded, you're just gonna wanna go to your downloads folder. You're done with Chrome for now. You wanna go to your downloads folder. And you're gonna get this. You're gonna open it up with WinRAR or just uh, you can use the Windows zip file program too. Doesn't really matter. You can use 7-zip. Then we're just going to drag it from here over onto your desktop. And that's your DLL and your injector. Now you're going to want to open up Roblox. You're going to want to find a game. Uh, this works on a lot of games. We'll do McDonald's Tycoon. Okay, once it's loaded up and everything's loaded in, I generally wait a little bit for everything to load in. You know, pretty good. You don't want your character be, to be gray or anything like that. I'm going to turn down this volume. Now you can go to your desktop, double click on the extreme injector, open that up. That pops up in an administrative window. You just want to click yes. You're going to select the program. You only have to do this once. After you do this once, it will always remember the program. You're going to click Roblox Player Beta. It's generally at the bottom of this process window. Now you're going to click select after it's high. If it's blue and highlighted, you're going to click select. And then it should say robloxplayerbeta.exe. Now you're going to click add DLL. Go to your desktop. Or wherever you ha uh, extracted those files to. Find the DLL. Now you're going to make sure this box is checked. And that it's here and everything. And you're going to click inject. Hopefully you get this and you get injection as completed successfully. This accidentally opened up Mozilla. Now from here, this is the script when you menu here where you can inject scripts and stuff. Down here is the commands. You can do CMDS. Get a bunch of commands. We'll do um, smoke me. There we go. Fire me. Smoke didn't work for some reason. Let's do PS me 1000. Yeah, okay. <laughs> pretty fast. We'll do particles me. I think I spelled that wrong. Yeah. Oh, there's an ID. Okay. Uh, let's do jump power. Yay. We can do. Let's do explode others. There we go. Just exploded everyone else on the map. Um, just do FF me, do FF all, and do explode all. Anyway, it works pretty good. That's all the commands. Well, that's not all the commands. There's a lot more commands here you can use. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll have a script pack in the description, and uh, you can guys can use that or whatever. But it's a pretty big script pack. It's got like over 4,000. Anyway, hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. Uh, wait, we'll do ahead and we'll go ahead and do something else. We'll do B tools. I'll show you that. There you go. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys for watching, and see you guys next time. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for all the support on these videos. Uh, I tried to get this one out really early. I've been busy this week, but this week I'll be able to get these out really, really early. So, after if you subscribe, hit the little bell button beside the subscribe button, so you get alerts and notifications when I upload. So you can use these before they get patched. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Uh, again, the, all this will be in the description. And see you guys next time.